What's going on everybody? This is Richard from Nothing But Nostalgia here to introduce our very first game for reintroducing the channel. And I'm just gonna let this play out for a little bit, see if you can guess it right away. I mean obviously that's how I was gonna say it all. This is just for nostalgia's sake. Back to scratch. Music up uh, uh, power. Oh, yeah. This is Tony Hawk's Underground. By far, probably one of my favorite video games ever. Um, easily one of the best Tony Hawk games that I ever really Yo, used as well. Uh, this would have to be my top one, and right underneath would be Pro Skater 4. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to hit Pro Skater 4 one of these days. I'm definitely going to throw it on the channel. But yeah, this game came out in 2003. Came out for the Xbox, the PS2, the GameCube, the Game Boy Advance. And I think it also came out for the PC as well. But uh, enough of that. Let's go ahead and jump into some uh, play through this game. So I'm just going to run it through. Let's go ahead and do story mode. We're going to do starting a new story. We're just going to do it on normal just so we can run through the game and, you know, just have some fun with it. Check it, man. Muska is actually coming to this dump for a skate demo. Get dressed, let's go. There you go. That's your best friend Eric in the game. Then right here, this is when we get a creator skater. Just for time's sake, I'm just gonna use one of the pre-made skaters just so it's easier. I don't want to spend a lot of time doing all this. Let's go ahead and use. It's a lot of good skaters. Oh, whoa, 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 what is that? Uh, here's Big Pimpin' Eddie V. I do like that. <laughs> Green Chick, got Big Lion. Tiger Swallow. Interesting. The suit. What the heck? Alright. Rasta. Oh, Daisy from uh, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. She was also an unlockable character, but she looks really bad in this game. Uh, let's use... Oh, Sheena. Oh, you know what? I've heard that uh, this pre-made character, Sheena, was in reference to the Ramones' as, uh, Sheena's a punk rocker. Uh, that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead. You know what? I'll just leave it to the normal pre-made skater. I'll just go ahead and change his hair really quick. Let's see. Let's make him look decent, at least. Give him a full hawk. Liberty Spikes and Pompadour. Oh, Eraser hair. Actually, he looks pretty bad. I'm just gonna use, uh, let's just use Jim. No, let's use Chad. I like Chad. Done and done. Well, I just got my ride all set up. Sort of. Looks like that thing's held together with duct tape. That's messed up. Let's go skate. Cool, cool. And now we're back in New Jersey. Where it all started. Home sweet home. What a dump. At least it has some killer spots. The old pool down by the high school. Scabland, the drainage ditch on the south side of town. And Elm Street, our own little strip of paradise. Complete with drug dealers who hate skateboarders. <laughs> Man, so many good memories playing on this level back in the day. What up, Eric? Hey, help me out here. I was just skating, minding my own, and the dealers grabbed my board. They tore it apart, and they threw the pieces up on the roof. My knee's wrecked. Could you grab them for me? My knee's wrecked. What a great excuse. Oh, man. Here, I'll hold your deck. Cool. So just in, just in case any of you never really played this game, this is the very first Tony Hawk game that introduced getting off your board for the first time. So you're able to freely explore like in a different way. Because Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4 and Pro Skater 3, uh, those are considered free roam games. But at least in this game, you're able to get off your board, run up the stairs, climb up roofs, climb up buildings. And it just kind of give a different perspective in the game, which is very awesome. You can do things like this. Cool. 
Oh, one of the very first games also that <laughs> let you drive a vehicle in a skating game. Knife in the belly. Jeez. Oh, well, lucky for them. Uh, my favorite type of games are racing games. So we'll see how bad I do. Handling is very bad in this game. Like I said, this is probably very unneeded in, in a Tony Hawk game. But you know what? It's actually kind of cool that they threw it in. Uh, nowhere by means it's the best. Like racing game or racing racing physics in the game, but the fact that they threw it in here just as an extra feature was actually kind of cool. And it changes up the game a little bit. Oh, just hit that checkpoint. That was pretty hidden. These controls are so bad. Here we are. Come back and kick it any time. You're a street warrior now. I'm a street warrior now. Oh, and that's, uh, this is going to be a pro skater right here. I think this is Mike Valley. Whoa, yep. Mike V. I knew you were a Jersey local, but... Hey, kid, just out skating? Cool. Me too. Hitting up the old neighborhood. <laughs> Want a new trick to practice? Get your special meter full, then hit up a flamingo. A flamingo. You go. Thanks, Mike Valley. This is Eric. Get you yep. done prancing on and off your board. Let's actually skate. At least I'm not too gimped to prance. How's your knee? I'll show you gimped. Let's see you land this. Melon. Easy. Well, well, someone's been practicing. Okay, Mr. Hawk. Try this. One. Mr. Bust Hawk. Bust the grab, then revert it as you land. Let's see you do it a few times. Reverse are the easiest way to get really big combos in this game. That's it. Enough warming up. You can't beat my score, and you know it. Why try? But to prove you wrong, Eric. I show what we got. Twenty-two thousand right there. First run. It's all about the reverse. Oh, damn. Yeah, like, when you bail out like that, um, I think that's, for some reason, you just double tap and go crazy on these uh, buttons and you get up faster, too. Especially useful when you're actually in a skate competition like this. When you're timed. Oh, just let me There you go. Ooh! Okay, <laughs> it came out of nowhere. That was probably really bad. There we go. Oh, Let's see if I can do this last combo right here. Keep this timer going. Oh, oh geez. Well, it's to beat him. Whatever. Damn, he's all buttered. All right, let's see what else this town has for me. Very good memories playing this game. You suck to see Muska's demo? Yeah, bet you are. Hey, since you punks aren't in school, why don't you go put up some flyers? <laughs> I'll give you free tickets to the demo. Try to hit all the telephone poles and wherever kids are skating. Actually, one of my very favorite gaps is right here. Easily, easily go around this a couple times. Hey, Muska's demo's about to start. Let's check it out. Let's check out Chad Muska. That's it. <laughs> I don't know why that cutscene's so short. That should have made it a little longer. A little cooler. I guess they made it for this cutscene.
got DVD player. Seven screens. <laughs> Muska, chilling, chilling. Where? Australia. See? That's how you hook it up. I mean, what's he done? Pop down a few rails and he's traveling the world, living like a king. Must be nice. Wow, Muska in Jersey? Unreal. I wonder if anyone could impress him. This spot looks cool. Yes. Oops. Sorry, Muska. Come on, open your car. Done. Hey, what's up, man? That was a sick line you had back there. Whoa, Chad Muska? I'm a huge fan. Dang, man, that's some ghetto ride you got rolling, though. Yeah, but I'm pretty broke. I gotta make it last. I hear you, man. Back in Vegas, I had no money, no place to stay, nothing, man, until my first shop sponsor hooked me up. So why don't you head down to your shop, check out their riders, and try to get hooked up? And yo, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Thanks. Damn, what a G. Mr. Peralta's not here right now, but if you want to be sponsored by a skate shop, you'll need to impress the riders on his team. If you get us to sign off on you, you're in. Cool. All right. Let's go see. I think this is a skate competition right So here. you want to be sponsored, huh? You gotta be able to put up big numbers under pressure. Think you can handle it? Yeah, sure. Okay then, let's see what you can do using our setup here. 20,000 points. Oh, oh. Of course, I've rested easy, huh? Jesus. You're local, right? Dude, I go to school with your sister. <laughs> oh yeah, right. Then you should know these lines. Though you'll probably need at least five tries to hit them like I do. Easily one of the coolest gaps and lines in Tony Hawk history. What? It took me six months to hit that line. Well, whatever, probably a fluke. See if you can hit this. Shoot! I'm gonna do that. <laughs> That's it. Alright, let's see. So I know that, that one you can bust a trick. You're Joey, right? Hey, I'm looking to get sponsored by Mr. Peralta, too. Right on. Well, let's see what you I'm pretty got. sure this I is going to be the skate competition right here. So go up oh, one transfer. side of the little trash pipe we got going and That's easy. Cool. Can I do a kickflip? Transfer. Easy. Let's see some variety. That's it. Cool. <laughs> what are you doing out here? Shh. The dealers took off with some gear from the shop. I'm trying to figure out how to get it back. Well, where'd they take it? Their place on Elm? Yeah. Left it on the front porch. So actually on this part of the game, when I was younger, this part used to be so hard for me, but Looks like I think I'm recently just playing through this game, so I kind of figured out the best way to do shot. it, which probably everyone knows how to Wait, do it this kid, way, but it's too dangerous. I just found it out. Oh. Should just jump over here. And literally this this part just takes you straight to uh Eric's board. Eric, what are you doing here? Well look, I got the stuff back. Awesome. Uh, you know you should get back to Peralta's before you get caught. What about you? Oh, yeah, I, I gotta finish doing something here. These guys are gonna pay. <laughs> this guy's nuts. Mr. Perilta. Uh, 
I'm looking for the owner, Mr. Peralta. Wait, are you THE Stacy Peralta? That's me. You the guy my skaters have been talking about? Well, I hope so. I'd like to be sponsored by your shop. Yeah, so would everybody else. I'll tell you what. Make me a sponsor me video. Show me what makes you different than Bobby B down the street, okay? And please don't hand me anything from the same old spots in New Jersey, dude, because I've seen it all. Done. No local spots and different tricks. Cool, cool. Dude, I just talked to Stacy Peralta. They know. Th those gangsters know it was me. What are you talking about? When I got back to my house last night, they were parked outside waiting for me. I, I, I gotta get the hell out of here. My cousin's got a place in New York. You've gotta help me get to the train station across the river. The cool thing about this game, they actually had like a decent Eric, story okay? mode. <laughs> I think we lost them. We gotta get out of here. If they find me, it'll be my name on this headstone. I'm hiding here with Headstone Harry. But headstone if we bring Harry. some scrap metal, he says he'll bang us out our ramp. And if we can get it set up, the street warriors say they'll give us a tow to get speed. Jump in the bridge is the only way to get past the cops. Dramatic. Quick, you gotta get the stuff for the ramp. And then if I remember correctly, this is the same exact spot where I had to get Eric's... Yep, where I had to get Eric's, uh... Eric's Side of the bridge, Johnny huh? Turbo. No I didn't even realize that was his name. Stop us. Grab the back of my ride and I'll get you up to speed. Then you try to clear the bridge. When I was younger, I had a hard time with this part too, because when you jump the bridge, you have to get it at a specific angle. If you go too far left or too far right, it okay, makes you feel the mission. Oh, did I do it? I did it. in the station. Please, man. We have to get out of town. The Elm Street dealers are after us. We're desperate. Didn't you see us jump the bridge? Ah, guess I was too busy stopping lion skate rats from sneaking into the station and spray painting. I, I am, am the, the king, king of, of no, no pants. pants on a phone kiosk. <laughs> What's your problem, Bacon Bits? Wake up on the wrong side of your mother this morning? Damn. Why, you little... Yeah, we're just gonna make this guy dizzy. Can I do it in one take? <laughs> Pork! Oh! I'm actually not a big fan of this mission, to be honest. Right here. I can go anywhere and get into anything around here. I rule! Show me that you're as elite as me, and I can get you a train ticket. Oh, the street is lava, so it doesn't count. I called it. Nah, nah. It's like, it's not too bad of a mission, but it is a little challenging. Than that. Bad at this one. Oh, got it. Okay. <laughs> I should have easily filled that one. Take the chase. Of course, the car's been faster than the skateboard. Just gotta grind my way over there. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. This is going really bad. Thanks, Johnny Turbo. Whoa, he's flipping a bitch. Here, take my ride. Man, probably one of the best endings of like a mission to end the level. Well, I can't even talk right now. Probably like, one of the best like missions to end the level. Easily. Super dramatic. Take my truck. Take my car. <laughs> Jesus 
super dramatic. Let's get the hell out of here! Come on! And that's it. We escaped New Jersey. Now we're in Manhattan. Let's see what's going on here. Big Bad New York. Peralta will be pumped if we can get some footy from the Brooklyn Banks, Veterans Memorial, the Pyramid Ledges, and 78 Water Street. Awesome. So I'm just going to go ahead and end it right here. Thanks again for you guys tuning into my channel again. And trust me, I'm going to play through this whole game. You're going to get a lot more content from here on out. And, uh, you know, like and subscribe to the channel. Watch my podcast on anchor.fm forward slash nothing but nostalgia. It's going to be on all major platforms for podcasts. And uh, tune in next time to watch me beat Manhattan. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.